This video is for CVPR 2020. My name is Ming Wu. I am a PhD student at the Department of Computer Science, University of Oxford. Our work is about the robustness guarantees for deep neural networks on videos. We demonstrate the motivation of our work by listing two crashes happened in Uber and Tesla self-driving cars when the autopilot mode was on. Ideally, if deep neural networks are employed in self-driving cars to carry out traffic recognition tasks, they should be able to correctly recognize a road sign, for instance, 80 miles per hour here, when the car is driving forward and the road sign is approaching. In other words, the input is a time series of dynamic images. However, we know that neural networks are vulnerable to adverse real examples. For instance, by applying just one single pixel, the traffic sign go right or straight is misclassified into go left or straight. Therefore, we work on the robustness of deep neural networks. To quantify robustness, we study the maximum safe radius problem, which computes the minimum distance from the original input to an adversarial example. We propose a game-based verification approach. Because we work with videos instead of single images, we extend maximum safe radius to that with respect to optical flow. And by utilizing Lipschitz continuity, we transform into a finite optimization problem. And this problem is further reduced to the computation of a player's reward when placed in a two-player turn-based game, where player one chooses which optical flow to perturb, and the player two then imposes atomic manipulations within the selected flow. And since computing the maximum safe radius directly is NP-hard, we develop algorithms to calculate the upper and lower bounds of it. We utilize optical flow to capture the dynamic characteristics of the moving objects in a video. Correspondingly, this is captured by a recurrent neural network. And we also use convolutional layers to extract the spatial features of individual frames. And by utilizing Lipschitz continuity, we discretize the neighborhood space of an optical flow sequence and consider only a finite number of points on a grid rather than infinitely many. We develop a gradient-based search algorithm to compute the decreasing upper bounds and apply the admissible A star algorithm to obtain the increasing lower bounds. Here we show the convergence trend of these bounds. We demonstrate some of our experimental results. For instance, we sample some frames from a hammer throw video and extract an optical flow sequence. By computing the bounds, we could obtain the unsafe perturbations imposed on the flow corresponding to the upper bounds and also the safe perturbations reflected from the lower bounds. For more naturally possible perturbations, we take the brightness change as an example. We can guarantee that any degree of brightness change, as long as below the lower bounds, are definitely safe. In other words, they will not cause a misclassification. Future work includes taking into consideration more physically plausible distortions, such as camera occlusion, left or right flip, and frame rotation. We can see that the camera occlusions are very similar to the safe perturbations we covered before. Finally, we show the scalability of the bounds in terms of the input dimensions. Intuitively, a smaller input dimension contributes to a faster convergence of the bounds. If you are interested in our work or have any questions, please don't hesitate to let us know. Thank you.